Well, this truck needs to be finished. It needs to go back in for surgery. I need to get the bed finished and sprayed in it. I never finished that. So that has to be next. Get it cleaned out. Get the bed and everything sprayed. And then uh, I got to pull the fuel tank out of this truck because it's got a small evap leak at the top um, fuel pump ring. And the fuel pump ring is all rusted and swollen in this truck, which was common in these trucks. I want to get the fuel tank and stuff out of the way and I want to scrape the back frame. Um, and then I want to fluid film the rear of this truck because it hasn't rotted through the frame yet, which thank, I'm thankful for because Papa's truck is a 13 and his frame did rot through. It's only got 140, 150,000 miles on it. Um, I'm going to do a DOD delete on this and I just got the long tube headers and everything in. I got long tube headers and stuff in for this, the collector, everything all the way back mid pipe. I'm going to figure out what I want to do from there. I'm not exactly sure exactly what the route I'm going to go yet with it. I do know I want to put kind of like a performance truck cam in it, get it a little lopy. Um, make it start making a little bit more power with this truck, open it up a little bit, tune it some, have some fun with it. But of course the DOD delete first. I'm going to go through uh, Texas Speed. You can get a DOD delete kit for around anywhere between $1,150 and $1,400, depending on how you want your cam spec'd out. Uh, I'm doing a 6.2 liter either this week or the beginning of next week. Probably beginning of next week. I'm doing a 6.2 liter in a uh, 14 GMC Yukon Denali, 6.2 liter. I'm doing a DOD delete in that one. And then right after that, I'm going to turn around and do a DOD delete in this one. I'm going to send the computer off and have it have the DOD programmed out of it by a company that uh, I found online. They're pretty reputable. It's like 125 bucks to have it programmed out and they ship it right back to you. As long as you're using a stock profile cam that matches the cam that was in there already, uh, there's no tuning really that's involved. Just turning the DOD off is all that you really need to do. And that's it. That's, uh, she's about to go in for surgery. She's going to be down for probably a couple weeks while everything is going on and this will be my next project truck I'm gonna let the missus have the f-150 and I'm not gonna really touch it too much to give the Chevy guys a little bit more attention and uh, we'll go from there I'll catch y'all later that's the plans on the GMC Sierra